We're living in a world where we need competent and versatile leaders. Leaders have great responsibility to navigate successfully uh, changes in order to create a better future. Our students are supported by professors who come from a range, a wide range of backgrounds, and they engage the students in dynamic learning processes. Some of the creative projects that I integrate, um, such as storytelling or embodied practices, aim to help students uh, stretch their comfort zone um, and to learn how to face the unexpected and the unknown, which is something that uh, most leaders have to learn how to do at some point in their careers. They lead us to learn with rigor, uh, with compassion. They want to challenge us to be the best whole person we can be. And that means our mind, our spirit, our heart, and our body. One thing we learn is compassion. I chose to do my master's in transformative leadership and spirituality in order to give deeper meaning to my vocation as a teacher. They get to bring their professional development and also their relational skills. And that in turn allows them to embody what transformative leadership is about. The students learn about the dynamics of constructive social change and how those dynamics support scholarship as well as leadership practice. So they gain a sense that uh, there's not only one way to become an effective leader and um, hopefully that is a sense of possibility that they can bring into their own communities and contexts. And the Providence School of Transformative Leadership and Spirituality offers both emerging leaders, new leaders, or leaders with experience, an, an occasion to bring together some of the things that they have learned and want to learn to address the critical issues of our time.